will see the brake setting of the main hoist and the brake setting of the city trolley motor. That part will check. And uh, this is the induct I P fifty five induction motor. This is coupled with the gearbox directly. And uh, here we have the uh, hoist brake, and that uh, after using it for uh, five six months, uh, there if it uh, if we use that hoist continuously or for more operations, then there may be some slippage of the load. So to avoid that, we have to readjust the brake of the hoist. So how to adjust the brake of the hoist? First, we will remove the uh, the brake cover. We will remove the cover, unscrewing the he uh, hex nut, hex bolt on the uh, cover on the motor. Now we can see that this uh, brake is uh, this is the magnetic brake. This is the electro electromagnetic brake. This we have uh, this coil of the brake. We have this uh, spring lo loaded. This is called a spring loaded brake. This the brake is applied due to this uh, pressure of the springs. And that springs are adjusted. We don't have to uh, change the length of the spring, and we don't have to adjust the uh, spring pressure. We have to only check that the air gap is proper. That the, there is the we can see the air gap between these two parts. That that we have to check, and for for that we have this. Uh, this is the coil, and we have to take out, uh, take out or take in according to when uh, we are uh, we want to minimize the air gap. In that case, we have to lose the these bolts from inside on this three, three board uh, studs, and that will uh, will uh, uh, lose that, and uh, that outside these three uh, nuts, uh, we have to. Tighten so that we get the equal air gap from three sides, and this is the fan because this is a fan pulled motor. So this is the fan of the motor. Now we will check the uh, air gap of the uh, brake and how it is to be maintained. Now we will see the how motor setting is done. In this motor setting, or motor setting, it is required when you will find a slippage of the load, and in that case, uh, we have removed the cover. And after removing the cover, first we will check the uh, air gap, and if it is more than the 0 0.7, uh, 0 0.7, then we have to reset it to the uh, level at the point minimum is 0.3. And the range is 0.3 to 0.7. In that case, we have to reset it to the minimum level. Now, the uh, how it has to be done? That uh, our uh, mechanic will show that how how it is to be done. Now, the he will lose the inner side of the uh, portion, the inner nut, and the he will then. Tight the outside nut. Again, we'll check the uh, air gap with the, with help of 
पिलर गेम्स वील सी दैट वेदर इट इज ऑफ रिक्वायर्ड साइज दैट इज ऑफ पॉइंट थ्री टू पॉइंट फोर दैट इज द मिनिमम एयर गैप ऑफ द ब्रेक how this is how we are setting the brake then after the brake setting uh, we ensure that these uh, two nuts are uh, fully tighter how brake setting of the main hoist to be done and uh, in the same way the trolley brake setting is also done this is the same method for the trolley brake setting the, uh, in that case also it is minimum is 0.3 mm okay this is all about this uh, brake setting part thank you